All right, welcome Zeds and Allens. I am Mr. Brightside X16, and we are playing Hero Quest today, or trying to rather. Uh, so Hero Quest is a basic tabletop little fantasy game made by Milton Bradley. It's pretty much Dungeons and Dragons, but much simpler. Uh, so this is a program on the computer. Uh, so we got to start a new game. Let's name it Hero Quest. All right, so the fire burns warm, but casts little light into the mentor's study. The flickering shadows only hint at the vast number of books and squirrels that fill the many sleeves. Slowly, mentor walks over the, to the fire. Well, my friend, your training is complete. You are not yet true heroes. You have to prove yourselves. But first, let me tell you of Zaga. Many centuries ago, Zagan was my apprentice. He worked hard and learned quickly, but impatience devout. He wanted to learn more powerful magic. I told him of the dangers and that he should be patient, for in time he would come a great shosha. But Zarka could not wall. Each night he broke into my study and read my spell books. The secrets that were held within them were great indeed. Once he learned these secrets, Zarka on foot. When I caught up with him, I found him greatly changed. He had pledged his allegiance to the great powers of chaos. Fool! He saw magic only as a shortcut to power and paid no heed to the terrible prices he would pay. I tried to treason with him, but to no avail. He laughed in my face and then unleashed a terrible cell, which I was hard pressed to counter for many days here. Okay, whatever. Let's go ahead and start. So basically, there's a evil wizard that we have to fight. Um, oh, okay, so I get to pick my spells for the wizard and the elf. So uh, yeah, basically Zargon sort of the dungeon master that we have to fight. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and choose water spells because that sounds alright. Yeah, water of healing. Heal the body with the water. Uh, so this is the elf spells gets the water spells and uh, the wizard gets everything else. Uh, so the trial... Uh, okay, you must seek out and destroy Varag, a foul, okay, whatever. I'll go ahead and click on, uh, this is my Barbarian, as you see, he's pretty strong, there's the Dwarf, the Elf, and the Wizard. Alright, uh, we're on to something. Alright, so, uh, in the game, on the actual board game, you got to roll the dice, here you just click. I get to move four little spaces, and uh, there we go. Okay. Uh, uh, ten. Oh, wait. wait. No. How, how many? Well, let me open the store. Well, I'll assume it stopped me. That was eleven. Eleven. Nine. That was nine. I can't count. Anyways, uh, let's open this door as well. Oh, there's some two goblins, and some other furniture. Search for traps, always good to do. No traps. Search for treasure, also no treasure. Oh, well, there's monsters about. Okay. All right, let's move our dwarf here. Right, and you got the 12. There you go, I can count now. 12, it, 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 uh, very, very swift at short distances, dwarfs are. All right, uh, we'll just put them right at, uh, well, let's move them a little bit so we can get the whole party down here if we can. And why don't you search for traps? No traps. Okay, great. And action. Uh, let's bring Mr. Elf here. Roll uh, And he goes three. A whopping three. He's very fast. Go ahead and end that. Uh, let's look for uh, some treasure. Why not? Hey, Pit Hazard. And I fall and hurt myself, the Elf. Uh, it's just not going well for the Elf today. Alright, let's uh, roll for the Wizard. That gets a seven. Doop a doop a doop a doo. Maybe I shouldn't say each, uh, each, how many times I moved here. Okay, there you go. All right, yeah, it's pretty self-explanatory. So you can search for treasure, search for traps. Um, if you search and find a trap, you can actually disarm it. And if you search for treasure, you actually get stuff. Oh, we must be defending now because of our barbarian. And yes, we're good. Successfully defended. Here comes the other goblin. All right, we're okay, we're doing all right. Let's go ahead and attack these bastards, and we'll do this guy, attack. Oh, okay, all right, I killed that guy. Um, all right, and then let's roll, let's get him further in. We can bring our dwarf friend to come help us. He 
yeah, let's, uh, well, I'll just come around to him. There we go. And here we can do a little pincer maneuver. The pincer maneuver. Attack. Alright, and he's still alive. Okay, that's great. Well, let's uh, get our elf to do something other than fall into pits. Silly elf. Not very nimble, huh? Alright, let's move him. Do, do, do. Be right behind the wizard. And search for traps. Alright, good. Don't fall into any pits. Alright, let's move the wizard. Uh, that's nine. And. Okay, never mind. Uh, well, I guess we're, yeah. Oh, that's, that's what I remember about the game. Uh, the hallways and doorways kind of. Oh, we're gonna defend. It kind of, um. You have to maneuver your characters just right, and it actually makes you feel like you're in a dungeon, so that's... Or else you get trapped behind each other, and god damn, this person won't die. Or, um, yeah, you can get into hairy situations. Actually, I probably could have passed uh, over the dwarf, but uh, whatever. Anyways, let's go ahead and attack with the dwarf, with the goblin, and... He's still alive. Oh no, he's dead. Yeah, we got him. We got him. We got him that time. Let's go ahead and move, whopping three, and just go over here, oh, yeah, go over here, there you go. Alright, alright, so here's the elf, let's go ahead and roll, uh, it's not going very fast, this elf guy. Alright, go ahead and add that. So yeah, you can move past your friends, but you can't uh, be on the same square as they are. And you, in, the, um, in the board game, everyone got to be one character rather than me controlling all of them which is kind of fun too though hey I found a gem great see you can find stuff not fall into things good old wizard all right barbarian let's uh, make you the first to do stuff and go into new areas so let's go ahead and roll you and you're going to open the store okay so as Oh, those were orcs, so that's a goblin picture, and this is... what the hell is this? Uh, okay, go ahead and tag this guy. Alright, go roll. Well, I guess it's a uh, scorpion from Mortal Kombat's um, ancestor, I guess. Alright, Mr. Dwarf, go ahead and take care of this actual goblin, other than those orcs we were fighting earlier that I called goblins. Go ahead and attack him. And hey, you know what? We killed him. Great. Good job, Dwarf. We'll keep you around. Alright, Elf. Let's, uh, let's do something cool here. Move you over there. And you're blocking a door, eh? Great. Uh, oh, God. I can't move him back. Okay, great. <laughs> yeah, I'm just working myself into these situations. Uh, okay. Oh, you can also search for secret doors. That's right. And treasure, and there's a pit hazard, so that's great. It's just he's just finding all the pit hazards. Alright, here we go. Defend. Great. Let's go ahead and kill this scorpion wannabe. Oh god, he's almost dead for freak's sake. Uh, okay, yeah, let's just leave you there. Now let's get our door friend help from the rear. There he goes. Uh, well, we'll go on the side here and attack. For freak's sake. Okay, so he's still alive. This is, I remember this from the board game. It takes a while to actually kill enemies. Uh, let's see if the elf can actually do something other than fall into pits. <laughs> Excuse me. Anyways. Uh, crap. No, I guess not. Mm. All right, let's use our wizard here to, um, I don't know, he'll just be there for support, I guess. Maybe we can, yeah, yeah let's search for treasure. Why not? Uh, oh, okay. Go ahead and defend. God, all right, let's go ahead and attack this bastard. There we go. He's dead now. He's died. He died. Got him. All right. Alright, uh, Mr. Dwarf, let's uh, let's you lead the way now, or not, or just stand there. Great. Right, open the door at least. Can go in? Oh, here we go. Okay. Whopping five moves. 
Okay, uh, let's go ahead and possibly end that movement. Yes, okay, and then we will. That's, uh, okay, uh, search for treasure, why not? Yeah, yeah, okay. Church traps? Alright, nothing. Alright, good. Uh, just stay there, dwarf. Alright, Mr. Elf, let's uh, just leave you there. And Mr. Wizard, let's search for treasure. Ah, oh, you always find stuff, wizard. No, not that time. Mr. Barbarian, let's go ahead and... Uh, oh, yeah, there we go. I found some gold. Great. Alright. And then Mr. Dwarf. Let's go ahead and roll. Let's get you over here. Ah, we can see. I see. So the when it pops up like that, it's a line of sight where we can see down hallways and into rooms full of fucking big ass guys like these guys. Oh god, these are chaos warriors. They're uh, yeah, they're pretty. They're pretty mean. So uh, let's try at least try to whittle them down till our barbarian can get here. And let's go ahead and attack one of them here. Anyway, so uh, just kind of remembering a little bit from, because I used to play this game a lot, but uh, I used to not keep my same character, so I'd constantly restart, and then uh, I would be playing this first quest a lot. So uh, just from kind of memory, I kind of sort of remember that uh, these Chaos Warriors were in here, and these goblins were in here, and actually I think Zargon is going to be, uh, let's get move our elf here. Uh, Zargon's gonna be in this little big room coming up, and once we go up to the northern part of the map, he's gonna be in a larger room. Uh, just him and a probably a couple more Chaos Warriors. So let's move our wizard here. Uh, hopefully our war dwarf doesn't die. Um, oh god. The Avengers. Oh. <laughs> oh, Jesus, you got it. Oh god. Oh. Okay, he's alive. Yeah, so uh, whoever made this uh, program, this free program, I might add, of Hero Quest, did a really good job of mapping out the same, the same exact quests from the board game. Uh, okay, here comes our barbarian, uh, but he stops a little short, so that's great. And uh, I'll go ahead and uh, search for traps for I don't know. I just feel like we're doing something. Alright, so let's go ahead and attack the Chaos Warrior again. Maybe I can actually hit him. Doesn't look like I did. Let's go ahead and get the hell out of here. Mr. Dwarf, run. <laughs> run. Alright, that's our elf. Uh, so, yeah, okay, Mr. Elf, who falls in all the pit traps, he will help us. He was. He, this is the most unlikely, un unlucky elf, really. Okay, Mr. Wizard, here we go. Um, maybe I should cast a spell, why not? Um, so, uh, let's see. Uh, he, ball of flame, that would be helpful. I guess I need line of sight, though, to do that one. Um, let's see here. What's this one? Heal body, that's good. Um, maybe I should heal the elf or even... Barbarian when I get a chance. Um, this one, rock skin. Oh, it looks very, uh, it's obviously a picture of the barbarian taking a shower. Yeah. Alright, uh, okay. So, okay. And all those, all the pictures from uh, this game are taken directly from the board game, so that's pretty sweet. Yeah, alright. Okay, Mr. Uh, let's go ahead and shit. Um, hmm. Let's uh, go ahead and heal. Right, no, eh, well, I don't know. I don't think anything can help us here at this point. We're going to have to wait till the Chaos Warriors maybe come out and face us. That's a lot of powerful spells here, though. And as you notice, um, I have all the other elemental spells whereas the elf just has the water, and uh, so we kind of traded, so the wizard doesn't have water spells, but the elf does. Oh god, here we go. Uh, defend! God, they really want to kill the dwarf. Oh god, he... Stay alive, friend! Defend, wizard! 
Why attack that with- oh, Jesus. Okay, we gotta definitely get the wizard out of here. Alright, come on, let's uh, bring our barbarian here. And let's actually try to save the day with him. Go ahead and attack. Okay, uh, I don't know if we did anything there. All right, go ahead and attack with our dwarf, attack this guy. And oh, we actually hit him. Great. Alright, uh... Oh, man. Hard fighting. Hard fighting. Okay, um... Bring over Mr. Elf now, and maybe he will cast a spell. I'm asleep. I'm now under healing. I probably should heal. Let's go ahead and heal her. Oh, I guess I don't got line of sight to the wizard. Uh, let's go ahead and cancel that. Uh, okay, so let's do something else. We can put someone to sleep. Um, no, I missed. Sneak around. That might be good. Uh, water of healing, I already saw that one. Uh, sleep, okay, let's go ahead and make one of the Chaos Warriors go to sleep. You go to sleep now. Hey, okay, he's asleep. Great, so you won't be having any turns, the one in front of the dwarf. Let's go ahead and start killing him in his sleep. Let me start moving here. Yeah, I'll go this way. Yeah, there we go. Alright, go ahead and... Uh, Oops, oh yeah, I already used my action. Well, we at least pits him and get the freaking wizard out of here. Let's go ahead and heal our wizard to self with heal body with its an earthy spell. Alright, already healed. That's great. I guess, I think you can get some potions, uh, but you have to buy that at the shop at the end of each quest. Oh, let's go ahead and defend. Alright, oh man. Elf, oh god. Oh, Jesus, he's almost dead. He's gonna die. Alright. Oh, I thought I put them to sleep. I guess he woke up. Damn it. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and attack. Let's go and get this one. Has two health. Oh god, one more. Jesus. Alright. Uh, so, Mr. Dwarf, I guess we'll use you. Let's go ahead and move our barbarian. Oh. Try to save him because he's almost dead. He only has three hit points left. All right, Mr. Dwarf, uh, let's put you here and let's try to kill this one with one hit. And what do you know? We did it. Yeah, teamwork. Okay, great. See you in hell, elf. You better get. Uh, well, let's do something here. Oh, I guess I didn't. Oh yeah, I did use the sleep. Oh god. All right. Um. Let's go ahead and uh, get him out of here and maybe we'll heal him while he cowers in the corner or falls into another pit trap. Alright, let's go ahead and heal here. Oh, yeah, it feels so good. The water of healing all over my face, neck, and chest. It's great. Alright. Alright, Mr. Wizard, go ahead and uh, cast your spell here. Something that will help. Mm -hmm. Ball of flame. Uh, huh. Well, maybe we can just go ahead and kill this guy, because I'm going to need this stuff for when we fight the boss. I'll go ahead and throw my knife. And my dagger's gone. Okay, great. Well, it was, it was worth a shot there. And he didn't kill him. <laughs> okay, and movement. Uh, defend! Defend. Oh god, okay, here we go. Alright, let's go ahead and kill him. Kill him, kill him, barbarian. Oh, a barbarian's over here. Well, okay, so a dwarf is gonna have. You're gonna have to do a dwarf. Alright, uh, there we go. Damn it. Okay, here comes our elf. Alright, here's the elf. He's done cowering in the corner. He's coming to save the day. And he has one hit point left, so that actually helped. Um, they're like, God, why did we bring the elf on this one? He's just not helpful. Alright, let's maybe get you in to do a swipe attack from uh, diagonally with your staff. Defend dwarf. Oh god. Alright. Um, let's 
go ahead and attack him. Get him. He should be dead now. Damn it. Alright, um... Well, tag him again. He's gotta die sometime. There he is. He's dead now. Alright, great. Oh, that was... That was something. Oof. Alright. Uh, we're pretty beaten already. We haven't even faced the Varag guy, that the boss guy we have to face. And you know what else? Uh, let's look for some treasure. And you find nothing. Well, at least he didn't fall into any pits. So that's great. Alright, uh, Mr. Wizard, um, ba -ba -ba -ba, let's get you moving. Do, 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 do. We can at least go see what's down this hallway. Oh, we'll go this way. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Okay, great. And uh, search for traps. No traps. Okay, great. Alright, Mr. Barbarian, let's go. Alright, okay, so I believe this is the room where uh, Farag's gonna be, so let me make sure there's no traps, and let me make sure all of our party's gonna be with us, so let's get the dwarf behind the barbarian, as they are the heavy hitters, um, but they might die, or... yeah, they might die. Okay, let's get our elf over there too, and then we'll come back and bring our wizard, because we're gonna need his spells. So yeah, I'm just going off of memory from the actual board game, because when you're uh, when you're the dungeon master Zorgon guy, you kind of have to set things up, and you don't do it until the person uh, comes into the room. So if once they open the door, go look down the hallway. You have to put uh, the furniture up that they see in their line of sight. Um, so let's go ahead and open, and then see if I was dungeon master, I would put all these things down, and it would be menacing. So yeah, the gargoyle guy is Zar uh, Varag, that we, he's a minion of Zargon that we have to kill, there's a couple of orcs and uh, another Chaos Warrior. We know how fun those guys are, huh? Alright, let's get our dwarf over here. Get him inside, let's, yeah, let's sacrifice the dwarf, we don't need him. Okay, go ahead and kill this orc, you should, should be able to do it. Great. Uh, let's get our elf over here and start casting all sorts of spells all over their faces. Let's do that. Uh, okay, I did sleep. Uh, oh god, all I just have is mist to walk around unseen and stuff. Uh, okay, so I can go through monsters, walk through monsters, and be unseen. Uh, let's save that until we have to run away or something. Alright, let's get our wizard over here. Nine, and uh, once we get our wizard here, we can probably start doing some damage to these guys. Let's go ahead and leave them there. Uh, let's see what if we can do anything that would help right now. Uh, Genie, Genie is pretty powerful. I can actually have him attack someone or teleport us away. Uh, Ball flame is actually really helpful too. All right. Okay, Zargon, you're a chaos warrior. Stay alive, dear dwarf. Oh god. Oh, he's dead. I killed him. I killed him. Oh god, defend yourself. <laughs> he died in front of our eyes. Oh, that was to the plan, huh? I guess we kind of knew that was going to happen. Oh, snap. Okay, now we can't really do anything till the freaking elf does something. At least to kill the orc. Uh, probably should move you from the door. Well, yeah, we'll just leave you there. I guess we'll leave you there. Let's. Uh, we'll have the. Um, well, I guess I could have moved the barbarian like this. Yeah, pass. I, okay, I just could have done that with the barbarian. But oh well. Okay, so Mr. Wizard, let's get you into a safe corner so you can cast some magic. Uh, so we'll come down over here to the other side of the room, and then we'll start doing some spells. Uh, yeah, one of these days. I'm gonna. Well, huh? Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Get him out of harm's way. He doesn't have that many hit points because he's a wizard. There we go. Great. All right. Uh, he seems kind of safe. Let's go ahead and cast something. 
let's do let's do the genie on we could do a genie on brag here oh yeah actually oh genie killed him the genie killed him great wonderful just got this chaos warrior to deal with so that was pretty much uh what we had to do and just had to go and kill this guy uh well now i can't really go any where now because the chaos warrior is blocking the elf so I can't go past the elf. Let's go ahead and try to fight him and we have no hit points. Let's go ahead and get the hell out of here. So when uh, you don't have to do the move phase first you can do the action phase if you want to do something first which I have been doing. Um, you kind of have to know <laughs> what you're doing. You're going to have to play strategically. So let's use this uh, ball of flame to kind of take away this Chaos Warrior's health. Nope. Alright, great. Uh, another fun fact of oh, defend about Hero Quest is uh, Dexter Lab makes a reference to it in uh, one episode they're basically playing Hero Quest and uh, Dexter um, chooses to be a Chaos Warrior, warrior when uh, DD becomes a dungeon master, but um, instead uh, Didi makes him a hobbit instead of like a little chaos warrior guy. Alright, let's get, oh, we, so we got our barbarian out there. Let's see if the, look, the elf can take him down. Do it, elf. Yes. Alright, that's good. So basically we're done with the quest right now, but for the sake of exploring and having fun, let's go ahead and uh, We'll check out all their other places, maybe look for some treasure and see what else there is. I'll probably pick up, uh, oh whoops, I'm trapped there. See another thing is uh, with the furniture you can't move past it. So you have to um, go, oh I found some gold. You have to move around the furniture and the enemies. It's basically about, this, is all, this whole game is about movement management really. Okay, so it looks like there's a hallway and some doors. And let's go ahead and get our barbarian about to flee so he can get out of there because he's about to die. And I don't have any potions or healing spells anymore. Alright, so Mr. Elf is coming here now. Uh, let's go exploring with our Mr. Elf friend. We look down that hallway, just some doors. Uh, let's see if I can make it over there. Probably not. Okay, great. There we go. Alright, let's go and roll. Let's pick up the dwarf stuff. Oh, he was my best friend. But hey, he had a short sword, so... Oh, god damn it again. Uh, oh. Alright, well... That's, I guess you can't use any of the dwarf stuff, but uh, he has it as keepsake. Yeah, I guess he just had a short sword on him. Uh, so this is the dwarfs. Yeah, okay. Well, alright, he doesn't have any of that. Uh, so, the elf has a short sword as well. So I guess since uh, my wizard just had a dagger, I guess we're just using fisticuffs now. Alright, let's go ahead and move there. And let's go ahead and get the barbarian closer to the exit. Oh well, we'll just leave him there. Uh, okay, so here comes our elf. We're gonna go exploring. Go ahead and open this door. Two goblins. No big deal. Go ahead and uh, I'll just rid the whole map of freaking enemies. So I guess if you didn't open that door, you wouldn't know if uh, the main bad with Batty was in the middle, but I guess this is a more of an easy first quest to do. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and move him closer. Let's get him so he can help out maybe if need be. Let's go past the wizard here. There we go. So he, he, can, he can kill some goblins at least. He, he can do that. Go ahead and talk this goblin. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, go over here. <laughs> Alright, let's play strategically. Um, hmm. Alright, let's go ahead and roll. Maybe the 
wizard will take a crack at these goblins. Go ahead, punch him in the face. Nope. Alright, great. Oh, oh, god. I guess that was a bad idea. Alright, well, no harm done. And shit, now he's there now. Okay. Uh, so with the elf, let's go ahead and cast a spell of the mist, and I can pass through everybody, including enemies. So let me go ahead and bamf on into the room. Bam, 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 bam. There we go. All right, there we go. Now, now I'm doing good with the elf. <laughs> All right, let's attack him. Punch him in the face. God. All right, kill them by punching him in the face since I don't have my dagger anymore. Defend. All right, great. All right. Uh, here comes the barbarian. Go ahead and finish this goblin off. Need your broadsword. Yes. All right. All right. So I think we can. Uh, we got ourselves. We can handle ourselves. Oh snap! So I searched for uh, some treasure. Instead, I found an orc. So that's great. I guess we shouldn't really search for treasure. Go ahead and punch him in the face. Okay, didn't punch him in the face. Defend. Ah, oh, man. Okay, so Barbarian, let's go ahead and cleave him in twain. And we did. Great. Alright, so let's maybe, I don't know, we can find some treasure, but let's not let the elf do it because he's finding monsters and pitfalls and it's just no good. Okay, so we got a goblin, an orc, and they're at church apparently with the Bible. Alright, there we go. With the elf, we're gonna go in. Do, do, do. I cast all my spells, so now I just have my short sword. <laughs> the wizard has a. Uh, just his hand since we tossed his dagger. Uh, which he looks like he has a staff in the picture, but he doesn't really have a staff. Alright, so get our wizard in here. Maybe we can cast some spells or just fight with our hand. Yeah, let's do something. Let's cast a spell. Swift wind, tempest, ball of flame. Oh, use that. Courage, fire of wrath. Uh... We can kind of save these, I guess. Uh, let's do the Tempest. We'll use it on, I guess, the Orc. And then he'll be in mobile for a little bit. So that worked. Um, goblin's gone. Defended. Uh, if, if I roll enough, I can go past my friends. Yep. doop a doop a doo just imagine like um, Mario, Mario hopping on their heads just to go by. <laughs> Alright, so let's get this guy. Destroyed him while he was in a tempest. Elf. Killed the goblin. Great. Alright, so we only... I think that's basically all the map. Let's see what's in this little room right here. Oh god. What are these? I don't know what those are. Skeletons or something. Okay, uh, god. Wow. Oh. Okay, so it looks like there's two more rooms. I thought this was almost done. Alright, so here we go. Uh, let's get our wizard to search for treasure. Found the potion of healing. Great, maybe we can use that. It's great. Uh, I wonder if I can give it to the barbarian somehow. Or, yeah, uh, let's take it. Potion healing, give item to Barbarian, give it to him, give it to him. Barbarian, give him the item. <laughs> he needs a take item, give it. Nah, I don't understand how you do this. Maybe I have to be right beside him or something. Okay. Oh, so it is skeleton. Defend skeletons are attacking. He just leaves skeletons in his closet. Uh, this frag guy who's dead. Alright. Okay, elf. Whoops. What's that? Oh. Okay. I guess not. Yeah. Uh, oh, I'm giving items still. 
I, well, I don't want to. Cancel. Yeah, it's not the wizard's turn, but I don't want to... Okay, I found a bug in the system. <laughs> There's a bug in the system. Oh, God. Uh, you cancel. Now he can attack, because it's... Yeah, he wasn't given anything. There we go. And, yeah, one skeleton down. Great. Alright, here comes... Oh, let's go ahead and retreat them all so the barbarian can go and finish this skeleton. Let's get the wizard here. Some backup. You can punch the skeleton or just th push him on the floor or something, this wizard. Uh, go ahead and attack with your one. You know, he only has one hit point, so maybe. Nope, it didn't, didn't happen. Didn't happen. Alright, let's go ahead and get our barbarian in there. Let's go ahead and take this skeleton out with one fell swoop. And he's alive still. This, this skeleton has good defense. He, they must have just been practicing back here in this room, the two skeletons, just sword fighting and parrying. Obviously this guy was, the skeleton was better than the other one. Get our elf over here. Ah. <sighs> And Hindustan, leave him there. Okay, let's punch him. Oh, let's cast this spell. Why not? Let's think of one that actually does some damage. Uh, courage. Fire of Wrath. Fire of Wrath, rather. Okay, so let's Fire of Wrath this freaking skeleton. And he's dead. Yay! There's much rejoicing. Alright, so Mr. Wizard, let's go over here. Barbarian and Elf to look at the last room. And let's try to give him the potion of healing. Get him right beside him now. Let's try to give it to him. Okay, I'm on his face. Uh, oh, okay, and moving. Oh, no, I guess not. Guess not. Maybe it has to be the wizard's action phase, maybe. I guess. I don't know. I guess I wish it could be like accept item on the action phase. Okay, uh, blue, blue, blue. go ahead and move the barbarian and open the door. Oh, Jesus, why did I do that? Oh, God. Okay, so obviously that's a mummy. I don't know what the other two things are. Okay, so I, I really don't remember this part of the board game from the first quest. I just remember killing uh, the main guy at the first little room. Uh, so let's go ahead and, uh, oh shit, he doesn't have really a weapon. Let's go ahead and cast a spell from the doorway. <sighs> Swift one, courage, oh god, I used that one. Oh, I don't really have any offensive ones. Rock skin, sure, use it on myself, because they're gonna come and kill us. <laughs> oh god. Oh god, defend. Oh, it's a zombie. A zombie with... Medusa hair. Ah, uh, okay. Well, the, the rock skin seems to have a mummy. Defend from the mummy. I guess the Varag just left these weirders back here. I guess these are his pets, really, for Varag. Alright, so we cleft that mummy, and uh, we're gonna go ahead and get this barbarian to kill the other people. Maybe, uh, maybe the wizard can actually give him the potion of healing. Alright, so Elf, let's see if we can... This is just a zombie, we maybe we can take him out. Okay, there's the zombie taken out. Alright, Mr. Wizard. I guess go ahead and, uh, well, let's see if we can... Yes, give, oops, give item to the barbarian. Give the potion of healing to the barbarian, accept it, <laughs> accept the item, and, uh, no, okay, definitely not working out. Um, I don't know how to use this system. Well, basically, since they were cards in the board game, you could just give the person the card. <laughs> but, uh, I don't know how to do it in this program. I click everything, click everything. Now it doesn't seem to work out. Uh, yeah, so that's the potion of healing. I want to give it to him. 
And, uh, okay. All right. It's not working out. Give it to him. Take the potion. Just a wizard trying to shove the potion down the barbarian's throat. Barbarian's fighting him. No, I don't want to drink it. For some reason, the barbarian has a Scottish accent. Or sounds like a leprechaun, I don't know. Anyways, okay, so let's get rid of this uh, zombie since uh, the wizard can't give this to him. Yep, definitely didn't get the potion. Uh, yeah, that's, that's kind of kind of funky, that. Oh, uh, yeah, it's not the barbarian's turn, you're right. Uh, God, there's got to be some way to do this. <laughs> Give it to him. Give it to him. Okay, well, let's go ahead and attack the zombie. Punch him in the face. He dodged it, or blocked it. Let's go ahead and defend yourself from the zombie. Hi, Mr. Barbarian. Let's get him. Cleave him down with our broadsword. And he's dead. Great. Barbarian's great. I love him. Him and his huge broadsword. Uh, let's go ahead and open this door. Why not? What, what could possibly be behind it? Ah, uh, Jesus. Uh, so we got two skeletons and a mummy. And looks like a tomb of some sort. So that's great. Just finding all sorts of enemies back here. Now what? I'm done. Let's uh, let's get the hell out of here. Get, run! Run, wizard one. Want to live? You guys go this way. I go home. Alright, okay. Here comes a skeleton. Let's go ahead and defend that. God. Oh, oh, the elf. The elf died. Defend yourself. <laughs> live, barbarian. Oh, Jesus, run. Run for the love. Oh, let's go ahead and attack back. Why not? Attack back. Maybe we'll take a few of them with us. Great. Now get the hell out of there. Run. Oh, God. I killed the elf. I... I know, that's why I'm running already. I know they were going to kill somebody. I'm out of here. Damn it, wizard. Come back. I'll take a shortcut here. <laughs> oh, God. Well, those are fast freaking... Never seen faster skeletons. And mummies and zombies. Oh, God. Those slow ass... Oh, yeah, really? I guess I'm winded at this point. Oh, God. Defend yourself. Ah, oh, God. Alright, let's go ahead and fight back. Fight, get the skeleton. Yes, we got the skeleton. Let's get out of here. We already discovered everything. We got a mummy after us. I'm already practically out the door with the wizard. Let's go ahead and get him out. Ah, oh, God. I think if uh, one character makes it to the staircase, we can just end the quest. Go ahead and uh, roll the barbarian, get him over there. Just in case both of them need to leave. Alright, let's go ahead and move the wizard. Alright, bye barbarian, see you later, I'm out of here. Wait, come back. You want to leave? Yes, hell, yes. Oh god, okay. <laughs> So we just ditched the barbarian, so let's go ahead and move the barbarian and get the hell out of here. I don't think the mummy's gonna catch up. Alright. So, okay, so that was basically the game. Pretty close to the, uh, the board game, uh, other than trying to give them that potion to the wizard. So, hope you liked it. Check it out. Um, it's a free game, completely free game. I'll link you guys up with the download and you can play Hero Quest again. All right, let's get out of here. <laughs> we lived, we lived. The wizard and barbarian, best of friends, lived to tell the day. Uh, okay, we did it. Well, we didn't clear the area of enemies, <laughs> and the dwarf and Alfred did. Yes. 
Okay. Oh, and then this is the shop. <laughs> on the board game, it used to just be back on the back of the the board, and then got to buy whatever you wanted. Uh, all right. So that is it from uh, Mr. Brightside916. I hope you had fun watching this. Uh, see you next time.